All right, what up, guys? All right, so basically here, Crush and I are going to explain to you guys basically how to play workshop uh, custom games with your friends. That means anything on the Steam store. So basically here under the uh, community tab under Rocket League Workshop, any map here, you can play with your friends. It's hella lit. Um, so basically, you're going to want to have Rocket League open to start this process. But uh, we're actually going to move to Google because uh, the first thing that you do need to download is Bacchus Mod. You're going to go ahead and click this and uh, that that's a tutorial in itself. So just search that up if you don't know how to follow the steps. Basically, it's super easy. Easy. You just click download now and it'll pretty much download. Uh, but once you have it downloaded, you're actually going to search this plugin. So from the home plugins, right? You go Bacchus Mod Home and you just search up uh, RL plugin or Rocket plugin right here. It's actually right here. So you don't even have to search it up. You're going to click install with Bacchus. So this is going to pop up. You're going to click open plugin installer. You're going to wait until this happens and plugin has been installed. Once that happens, you literally just click enter. It goes away. Enter on the keyboard to confirm. Uh, you click OK or X. It doesn't matter. Uh, so now that you have Rocket plugin installed, you can actually close out of that. You don't need anything here. You go over to RO Lobby. Same thing. Install with Bacchus Mod. Uh, I already have it installed, so I'm not going to install it again. Same thing, you know. That little thing's going to pop up. You're going to... You're going to click enter as soon as it says finish installing and go ahead and exit out of that when that's installed and then you're going to search for rocket host and then you're going to install that with Bacchus mod the same process that little black little kind of like data center whatever it's called is going to pop up wait for it to say finish installing you can click enter and then we're going to move on to here so basically this is what this is the part that's going to allow you to play on the custom maps this link right here don't click the ones below those are not the ones click the one that says usa2 rocket league maps we'll have all the links in the description we'll link all the plugins we'll link Bacchus mod um we'll link everything that you need from google basically you click here it's going to take you to this it's going to say not secure don't worry about this i've downloaded this many times before uh and a bunch of my friends have it and none of us have ever had an issue with this so you click download latest release now something's going to come up if this icon doesn't come up, if it's like a white little folder, you're going to want to go ahead and click the link in the description that says WinRAR. And basically what you're going to want to do in WinRAR, for those of you that don't have WinRAR downloaded, it's a little confusing. So I'll walk you guys through it. I'll just re-download it myself. Uh, you're going to click it. Something's going to pop up. It's going to say user access control. It'll be like a little thing that pops up and you're just going to say, yeah, agree or yes. Okay. This is going to pop up. You're going to click install. Um, you're going to make sure this checkbox is, is, is popped up. I don't know why, but I just, I, I saw that in one of the videos and that'll just automatically come checked off. I checked that off previously, but just make sure it's checked. Um, click okay, click done. And then this is going to pop up. This is just, ju this is just publicity at this point. Now it's downloaded. Don't even click anything in that. You really don't need it. Uh, so then you're going to go back to this and you're going to re-click download latest release and then now it'll pop up with this little symbol previously it'll pop up with that white little file if you don't have uh winrar or just anything to uh unzip the files so if you have something that unzip files then you're gonna be chilling but if you don't like most people don't uh, like most people do uh you're just gonna go ahead and download winrar uh and then and then you re-download this and then now we're at this step so you open it up WinRAR is going to come up with this buy WinRAR, whatever this is. Just actually exit out of that. You're not buying WinRAR. And you're going to minimize this. Minimize anything that you have open. And pretty much just take this to your desktop. Um, and you're actually just, this folder, don't even touch this folder. But this folder that says latest release, you're just going to go ahead and drag that out of your desk, out of this folder, just so that's a little easier to access. Um, so make sure you have Bacchus Mod it open at this time. Basically, you're going to go into this folder. Don't touch anything here other than winter RL. And you're going to want to keep this in this folder. Uh, sometimes you can take it out, but some people have had issues if you like drag it out of the folder and put it on your desktop for easier access. Sometimes it doesn't work. Sometimes it like automatically shuts down. Sometimes it closes and like crashes. Um, so just leave it in this folder and it should work 100% of the times. So this error message is going to pop up. Uh, blah, 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 alpha release, whatever you click. Okay. Um, and then it's another more things are going to pop up, but because I already have it installed, they didn't pop up. It's going to say, uh, do you want to install alpha console as one of them? Do you uh, want to install RO lobby RO plugin? And basically those three things, 
just say uh, no, 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 and no to. Uh, basically, you already have those installed, so if you click yes, it's just going to take you to the Bacchus mod link. Uh, once you're here, basically this is where you download the maps. So you can browse all the maps on the Steam Workshop. Um, you can just browse all the ones that you want, you know, uh, and whichever one looks cool, you can go ahead back to this little thing and then you can find the map here. So just kind of generally search, like, let's say we want inverted drop shot, uh, drop. Okay. Bad example. Let's say you want like uh, a very popular one that, that me and my friends play, uh, is, um, shark battlegrounds V2. Oops. I don't know why I did that. This one. Uh, I highly recommend starting with this one. It's just a basic. Basically, it's like it's like seven Rocky League maps in one. Like you have to score three goals in order to really score one. It's it's complicated explaining it. Trust me, if you play this with like a 4v4, it's the funnest thing in the world. You're going to want to click download and install. For me, it's I already have it installed. So I'm just going to click no. But it's going to say, do you want it to create a location for it to download or something along those lines you're going to click yes and then you're going to click download and install one more time and then this green bar there's going to be this bar is going to turn green and it's going to slowly download right now it says connecting to google um here let me show you with a new map that i don't have downloaded i'm just going to download a random, a random one i'll download shipment um and right now it'll show you the picture here um and you click download and install basically it'll do this exact same thing and then you're just going to wait for that to download. And basically it's going to say done right here. And as soon as it says done, you can go ahead and come back to this. So you're going to put this aside and then you can come back to this and you're going to search for shipment. The map you just downloaded. You're going to go here and click subscribe and then let this download here. And basically that allows you to have it in your um, Rocket League and in the in the Bacchus mod. So you need to have, be, have it in the Rocket League like textures and in the Bacchus mod menu. So basically, once you have that downloaded, it's going to say done right here. So make sure it says done. Uh, don't close out of this when you're in Rocket League. Um, just always have this open whenever you're playing workshops. I highly recommend it. It doesn't take any CPU, so it won't lag your game. We've never had an issue with that. So when you go to join... Um, to join or host a lobby, um, to join, or actually I'll, I'll do the host first. So to host, you're going to click F2. You're going to go to plugins. Uh, you're going to go to rocket host. You're going to go to open rocket plugin GUI. This is going to pop up. Let me do these separate so we can see this a little better. So th there's only two servers. There's us East and Germany. Uh, if you're in the U S you use us East, obviously, uh, you do have to click enable workshop maps. Basically, right now, what I'm doing is I'm setting up uh, the lobby for everybody to play on. And here are all the workshop maps that I have downloaded. Basically, you can search them. I'll show you shipment, for example, um, just because I just downloaded that. And make sure this is to eight players so that you can get eight players. Uh, you don't need your IP address. This is just a random IP address. That's not even my IP address. So I don't even know what that is in a random port. So ignore that before you needed an IP address and you needed to do something vers with Hamachi and like replacing a map like underpass or something like that. You actually don't need to do that for this process. You go to mutator settings, you change whatever mutators I highly recommend unlimited uh, and boost amount unlimited as well. Those are like the default ones that we always play. And then a big thing is you need to click enable RO lobby right here. Uh, and that basically will allow you for everybody to click F3. Basically, I just clicked F3 for this, and then it popped up. And as you can see right here, uh, uh, there's three people currently running um, games right now. Uh, right now, there's two. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and request a server. This is gonna click. This is gonna say server online. Click to join. Now you can just ignore that. Then you go over to RO lobby for all your friends. You're gonna tell them click F3. Oops. This is gonna pop up. Shipment. You see this for them that had it open. All they got to do is click refresh. But if they just open it up. That you literally can put a password on it, but you don't even need it. You click connect. Now this error is going to pop up. This is 100% normal. 
Don't even worry about this. It's going to say content mismatch or it's going to give you another error, but it's a Rocket League error. So basically, like this is a game error, right? Click OK. You actually need to restart your Rocket League because you just downloaded the maps. All the textures have not been downloaded to the game. And that's why it says content mismatch. So then you can go ahead, go ahead and restart it. Wait for it to load. And then all you have to do from this point is wait for it to load. And then once you get into the game, you just have to click F3 again, as I show you right here. F3, the lobby's still up. Eventually the lobby will fall if it goes past like four or five minutes. So you do have kind of like that four or five minute window to join it just so that there's not like a ton of lobbies here. So go ahead and click shipment, click connect, and you'll be into the game. Um, so anybody that downloads maps through Winter RL, Winter RL, when I say win it's this little tiny little thing right here. Um, whenever you download a map through Winter RL and subscribe to it on the Steam Workshop, make sure you have your Rocket League open. Um, it, I don't think it really matters if you have it closed, but just it's a lot easier. Um, and then that first time that you go ahead and play Rocket League, you know, as soon as you try and join that for the first time, you're always going to get that error. So don't even be afraid if you got that. Go ahead and restart it, and then you'll be good to go pretty much. Um, nothing else is required. All your friends can do this. All your friends don't need to go through Rocket Host, and they only need to go through RO Lobby, and you'll be in the map now. And you can play any workshop map with 4v4, 3v3, 2v2, and do anything that you guys want to do. And uh, that's crush and eyes guide on how to uh on how to join workshop custom maps with your friends thanks so much for listening and i hope you guys uh, enjoy custom maps and we'll link our discord servers in the description if you guys have any questions feel free to join them we're always running games we always need more members to run games with so please hop in for real hit us up we're always running these games late night all right hope to see you guys soon deuces